Hi, I'm Juan Loiza, and I'm going to give you a quick introduction to Oracle Exadata X8. So first of all, Exadata has been on the market for over 10 years. It was launched in 2008, and today it's an extremely successful product. It runs many of the most mission-critical applications in the world, including petabyte warehouses, supercritical financial and e-commerce platforms, and the most complex business applications in the world, as well as massive database consolidations. In Exadata X8, we continue our tradition of bringing state-of-the-art technology into the Exadata platform. So Exadata X8 updates the database servers with the latest generation Intel Cascade Lake processors that are 15% faster than the previous generation. We continue to use our ultra-fast InfiniBand fabric for communication. And we also bring the latest technologies into our scale-out intelligence storage servers by bringing the latest Intel Cascade Lake processors with 60% more cores than X7, and also a new generation of drives with 40% more storage. In addition to updating the components in our existing Exadata, we also have a new type of Exadata storage server, the Exadata Storage Extended, or XT server. The idea here is to drastically lower the cost for infrequently accessed older or regulatory data. As usual, the combination of new hardware with innovative new software greatly improves performance in this generation of Exadata. For example, we have 60% more throughput in our all-flash storage, and we have 25% more IOs per second per server than Exadata X7. And these numbers, of course, are dramatically faster than any all-flash storage array on the market, and they scale as you add more racks. Now let me talk about the Exadata Smart Software, which is really the secret sauce of Exadata. So first of all, for analytics, of course, we have our ability to offload data-intensive processing into storage, and that has only gotten better with Exadata, and that's what drives the hundreds of gigabytes per second of throughput. We also have our technology that greatly reduces the amount of I.O., such as our uh, database aware flash caching and our storage indexing technology that eliminates IOs that are not needed for a given query. And we focus very heavily on bringing columnar technology to greatly accelerate analytics in Exadata. So we have our Exadata hybrid columnar compression technology which squeezes the size. But lately we've introduced a new generation of columnar technology that's focused on performance by using our in-memory database columnar formats to bring uh, fast vector processing algorithms directly into Exadata storage. We'll also be introducing Intel Optane DC persistent memory into our columnar technology to make that even faster than it is today. For OLTP, we have many unique algorithms in Exadata. For example, we're able to eliminate the traditional I.O. bottleneck using our scale-out storage, ultra-fast NVMe flash, and ultra-fast InfiniBand. We also have specialized algorithms for logging that make transaction processing much faster. We have specialized algorithms that bypass any sick or broken components. And lately, we focused a lot on new algorithms to eliminate the bottleneck when communication within a cluster across the different servers. Examples here are our ability to communicate directly from the database straight to the networking hardware, which speeds up uh, networking by up to three times. The ability to move data between nodes without having to write it to the log, and the ability to access data in remote nodes using RDMA technology to speed up transaction coordination. We'll also be introducing the new persistent memory technology for accelerating OLTP. Here we'll use the persistent memory both to do I.O. operations much faster, but more importantly, to allow us to use RDMA technology to access storage directly bypassing the entire software stack, which makes the latency of OLTP operations 20 times faster than before. And we'll use this as a shared cache to create high capacity, and of course we'll mirror the data across multiple storage servers to ensure that any kind of failure won't lose your database data. Okay. So Exadata, we've talked about the hardware and the software. We also have unique cloud deployment models for Exadata. So for example, we have our Exadata cloud service where you can, at a click of a button, provision a brand new Exadata where Oracle experts deploy and manage all the infrastructure and you pay based on a subscription-based model only for what you used and only for the CPUs that you want to enable at any given time. 
Of course, not every customer can move their workload to the public cloud, so we also have the ability to bring that same Exadata cloud technology into your data center using the Exadata cloud at customer deployment. This is very simple. We use the exact same hardware, software, interfaces, API, and control plane that we use in our public cloud, but we run it in your data center, and again, we charge you a subscription as if it was running in the public cloud. Exadata is also the foundation of the Oracle Autonomous Database, the next generation technology that will greatly reduce your cost while improving your performance, availability, and security. Now, the database technology that we're implementing for Autonomous Database, we're going to make available on all aspects of the Exadata platform. For example, the automatic statistics gathering that we do for autonomous database that prevents stale statistics will be available on on-premise Exadata as well as cloud Exadata and autonomous database. And also the machine learning algorithms that we've implemented to create indexes online based on your running workload will also be available on Exadata on-premises as well as our cloud and autonomous database. So thanks for joining me today. As you can see, the Exadata advantages increase greatly every year. We're making the platform dramatically better in terms of performance, cost, availability, manageability, and security. For more information on Exadata, I invite you to visit us online.